Hey, Bears fans! I'm Derek and I'll update you on everything happening in Chicago. The Chicago Bears have consistently demonstrated their strategic prowess, and their current utilization of the waiver wire priority list is no exception. Recent moves have spotlighted their focus on bolstering the defensive front seven, with notable acquisitions being defensive tackle Bravian Roy and linebacker Michael Walker, hailing from the ranks of Carolina and Atlanta respectively. As the team forges ahead, it is evident that Poles remains committed to fortifying their roster with established depth across all positions. Within the Chicago Bears roster, the wide receiver position emerges as a compelling narrative. While luminaries such as DJ Moore, Darnell Mooney, and Chase Claypool naturally dominate the top tier, the landscape becomes less distinct beyond this triumvirate. The preseason opener against Tennessee unveiled some uncertainties, with both Valus Jones and rookie Tyler Scott struggling to make a significant impact. Amidst this backdrop, Tyler Scott's position appears secure, yet the episode underscores the lingering fragility of the position's depth. The city of New Orleans emerges as a potential wellspring of opportunity for the Chicago Bears, as they seek to refine their receiving arsenal. James Washington, once a pivotal second-round pick, resonates with this narrative. His notable exploits during the 2019 season with the Pittsburgh Steelers, amassing an impressive 735 yards, underscore his capability to thrive within the NFL arena. Regrettably, the emergence of Claypool during the subsequent offseason gradually eroded his playing time. A hopeful transition to Dallas in 2022 was marred by a training camp injury that kept him sidelined until December. A stint with New Orleans in the recent summer ultimately yielded no substantial breakthrough. Undeterred, the 26-year-old Washington remains resolute in his pursuit of the next career chapter. While James Washington may not be synonymous with precision route running, his distinct skill set finds resonance in his vertical prowess. An exemplar of his college success lay in his adeptness at gaining separation deep downfield, complemented by his exceptional ability to track the ball. His track record also boasts a knack for securing difficult catches amidst traffic, an attribute that has cemented his reputation. Enter Justin Fields, an aspirational quarterback known for his penchant to exploit downfield opportunities. The union of Fields and Washington presents a tantalizing prospect, wherein their synergy could potentially yield fruitful results. Furthermore, Washington's physical mindset renders him an apt contributor in the Chicago Bears' wide zone scheme, extending his influence beyond the receiver role. The inclusion of James Washington in the Chicago Bears' fold represents a quintessential illustration of a low-risk high-reward proposition. Positioned as a potential fifth option within the receiver hierarchy, Washington's profile encompasses both unexplored potential and proven attributes. As the Bears' roster matures and takes shape, his presence could yield a pivotal impact, fortifying their offensive arsenal and enhancing the versatility of their gameplay. The Chicago Bears' ongoing pursuits underscore their unwavering commitment to fostering a robust roster that capitalizes on hidden opportunities. The narrative surrounding James Washington paints a picture of resilience, adaptability, and latent potential. In your opinion, what do you think? Would James Washington be a great target for Ryan Poles to add to the list? Leave your analysis in the comments. Remember to support the channel, leave your like and subscribe. Don't miss any update, news or insight about the Bears, always stay ahead. See you soon.